We're at Desert View Elementary School and I'm the physical education teacher here and we are showing you how to do the new PE. Now this is very important. Warm up and stretch. Did we just warm up outside and stretch? Do we need to do it again? No. Our main focus is on the technology and on heart rate monitors because we feel that if we want to find out what the children are doing then the best way is to look at what their hearts are doing. My feeling is that we should try to to reach children at their level, and certainly the video games is their level, and that's where they're at. I enjoy the um, the dance pads. They're really fun, and you get to just dance around and fool around. The one game you saw today, the eye toy, is one that they just got, so the kids are really excited. It takes your body movement, and when your body movement, or a certain part of your body, hits one of the eye toys, you either have to dodge it, or if you don't, it'll hit you, and your points will be rejected. With the change being to the new PE, where we're not going to see a kickball being thrown out anymore or dodgeball. It's going to be fitness training. Our children learn here what the fit principle is, which is frequency, intensity, time, type. They learn to train in their target zone. And these are lifelong skills. And this is what will change physical, make physical education the healthcare system for kids today. We had half day yesterday, and because we have an early release day, and the second graders are looking, it's day five, it's day five. Well, where's PE? He says, oh, it's early release. Oh, we're not having PE. <laughs> so they've always enjoyed coming to PE. <laughs>